In this video, I will show you a super fast way how you can turn on and off tracks in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad very fast. It took me a while to figure this out. You need a keyboard for that and we are talking about DaVinci Resolve on the iPad. So if we are here in DaVinci Resolve, and let's say I have a couple of different video layers. Those are called tracks. And I can go in here, right? And I can click, for example, the lock button. If I want to lock a couple of them, I have to go manually and lock them. Then the same thing happens for the uh, auto track selector or maybe here for the disable this track so I don't see any of that. Lock basically just means I can't manipulate anything on that track and disable means I don't see what is lying here on that track, okay? So, but what if I wanna select a couple of those at once? Because you can't like do the same like here, it doesn't work like this, you, it doesn't work. But what you can do is you can use the shift and the option key or alt key on your keyboard. So for example, when I go with shift and I click for example here on the lock, I lock all of them at once. Same if I still click it and unlock all of them. And with the Alt key, for example, if I go here for disable video track and I click this one, only that one is visible and all the other ones are deselected. If I do the same here again, it's the opposite or I can deselect this one. So this is a way how you can fast unlock, lock tracks and disable or unable or make visible the, the tracks in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad. I hope you learned something. If yes, hit like, subscribe, ding-a-ding -ding and the bang-bang-gong and we see us in the next video. I'm Daniel. Bye.